one big thing. In this first weekend of college football, we remember and celebrate the many traditions that are unique to schools all across the country. The things we miss so much during the eight months without the sport we love. Many have been around for decades. Others are brand new. One in particular from the Big Ten was tremendous. Not talking about the hot tubs at Rutgers, but hey, way to go Rutgers. You guys do your thing. I'm talking about what happened Saturday at Kinnick Stadium in Iowa City. The new children's hospital that's been built there overlooks the stadium. And from a dozen floors up, you get a great look into the stadium that's been around almost 90 years. The Iowa football team already has what they call kid captains for each game. Pediatric patients from the hospital who serve as honorary game day captains. But what about the other kids and their families up there on the top floor looking down on game day? How about a little something for them? A post on social media suggested everyone in Kinnick Stadium ought to wave to the kids in the hospital at the end of the first quarter of games. And that suggestion went viral. The Hawkeyes game Saturday against Wyoming was the first opportunity to see if this was going to be a thing or not. It's a thing. Now, maybe it's because I'm a sap, which you know about me. Maybe it's because my wife and I were lucky enough to welcome another healthy child into this world just this past week. Maybe it's just because I'm human. Whatever. The sight of 75,000 people, all of them, looking up and waving at children who are battling illnesses genuinely moved me. It's so simple, but so undeniably warm and kind. And once again, it's just so human. The type of thing you see for the first time and think, well, they should just keep doing that until forever. You don't often know when you witness the birth of a tradition, but I'm pretty sure we did on Saturday. So well done, Hawkeyes. Well done.